Biomimicry, it's basically about learning from nature. And you learn from nature and the result is innovation inspired by nature. And I actually think it's sustainable innovation inspired by nature is the result. The focus of Biomimicry New England is to establish nature as an important resource for education and innovation through the sciences, technology, engineering, the arts, and math. These goals are being put into action by working with schools at the K-12 level, developing courses at the university level, and collaborating with organizations to engineer through nature. About biomimicry, we like to point out that nature's R&D lab has been in business for 3.8 billion years. Uh, chances are there's something she can teach us, uh, hence biomimicry 3.8. Um, and if you think about it, considerably less than 1% of all the species that ever lived are alive today. So we've got the successful survivors as our lesson book. But if you think about it, spider silk. Spider, the tensile strength of spider silk is five times stronger than the tensile strength of the toughest steel we can make. And how do spiders do it? They make it with local materials. They make it at ambient temperature, ambient pressure. Water is the solvent. This is the way all of nature makes everything. And to me, the way towards sustainability is biomimicry. Because it's not every organization is going to accept sustainability. Some companies do. They're getting better. But innovation, everybody wants. In the business world, everybody wants innovation. And have we got a deal for you? 3.8 billion years of R&D, and almost nobody's tapped this incredible library. It's a huge opportunity. And yet, this is a new approach, learning from nature. So the next time you have a problem, ask yourself, how would nature solve it?